You made me a champion. Imagine you're a student called on to read out loud in front of your fifth grade class, and you can't do it. When you come to school every day and you have difficulties, it's not a place you want to go. For students in the Kenton County School District, that uncomfortable scenario is happening less frequently thanks to a reading intervention program called Read 180. Read 180 is a research-based reading program that's designed for students who have struggled in traditional reading programs. Read 180 has a built-in progress monitoring system. Students are tracked, every keystroke that they have on the computer is tracked as far as speed, accuracy, uh, so that we know that students are making progress. In your own words. Read 180 is a comprehensive system of curriculum, instruction, assessment, and professional development proven to raise reading achievement for struggling readers in grades 4 through 12. In Joanna Forbes' 5th grade Read 180 class, the boost in student achievement has been impressive. Oh my gosh, you know, I was really skeptical about this program at first. I had heard lots of great things, but I just didn't know what kind of results I would get. And the very first time that we took the, an SRI test, which determines what their reading level is, you know, I had a score and they were all below average. Then we took another one after our first trimester of doing this program. Every single student in my class raised their reading level. Every single student. And that's when I, mean, I was taken away, I was blown away. After the first trimester, I had seven students reading on grade level. Now here it is at the end of the year, and I have 11 of my 20 students that are reading on grade level or far above. And I, I just can't, I don't know what else would give results like that. This teaching method consists of four stations, whole class instruction, an independent reading station, small group discussion with the teacher, and computer learning. Great, that's it for this round. I just, I think it works because it's something different. It's not just textbooks, it's, you know, it's interactive and it's really geared towards the students. And I feel like it's, you know, textbooks are sometimes very wordy and written in a difficult language where this program kind of, you know, meets the needs of the students uh, that are struggling. Fifth grader Grace Bentley used to be one of those students. She struggled with reading, vocabulary, and spelling, which according to her mom, Lori, left her shy, uninterested in school, and lacking the confidence needed to maximize her learning. Before Read 180, when I came to school, I was kind of a little bit nervous about reading out loud to everyone because I might mess up, and now I feel confident in myself and that I can do it. She's absolutely more confident. She is has a lot better outlook on coming to school. She enjoys coming to school. She plays school at home even on the off days, so I've really seen that passion in her again. It is working. We're seeing great gains in student achievement, uh, Lexile levels that have doubled and sometimes tripled for some students. Even high school students are engaged um, in the program. And the biggest gain that we've seen is that students have changed their attitude toward reading and even toward school in general. It's gone from a negative attitude toward reading, not wanting to read, to becoming very positive and even excited about reading. That student excitement carries over to parents as well. Grace's mom, Lori, gets emotional talking about the positive direction her daughter Grace's school life is heading thanks to the Read 180 program. It means a lot. It means a lot to me because I know I struggled when I was in school. And I know the difficulties that I had and wishing that I had had something like this. So it's a, it's a blessing to me to know that my daughter um, and other children have the ability to get the help that they need. If you're interested in more Read 180 information, contact your child's school.